Hello and welcome to this presentation. My name is Lee Snyder, the Product Manager for Trimble Solutions. And what I'll be showing is the new extension that's available for download on the Tecla Warehouse called the Joist Flush Frame. We received several requests to be able to create a connection like this. These are a few filled photos, so you can see the different framing scenarios that were requested. Typically what happens is that you would have joists that would be sitting on a bearing plate or on a column or on a joist girder. As you can see, we already have components for that but there are scenarios where you would have these joists that would actually be flush and so we wanted to come in and create that as well. So once it's installed, it'll be installed here to your applications and components if you're using 21.1 uh, or if you're using 21.0 and older, it'll be in the component catalog. But if I just come in and activate this, I can pick the primary member, I can pick the secondary member, and then it begins to add in this framing material um, as required. So here I have the connection plate that'll be welded to the girder. And then I also have this joist plate. This will actually be part of the joist. So the joist manufacturer would provide this plate. This just allows you to line up the, the framing holes so that everything can be fabricated correctly or detailed by the detailer or still fabricator. So if we come in and open up these properties, this is very similar to any other uh, component that you would find within Tecla. I'll just change the uh, transparency here. You can see that there's uh, various options for creating uh, stiffener plates. If we wanted to put one on the far side, we can do that. Just go ahead and hit modify there. I can also make that an angle and I can define uh, the profile information here on the stiffener tab. Here on the connection tab, joist plate, stabilizer, bolts and welds, just as you would expect. So a uh, nice little new addition to the already growing uh, joist components here within the catalog. We'd encourage you to download it, send us any feedback that you may have, and we hope you enjoy this new development.